new cases of the measles right here in the metro and would could impact your children. The Liberty School District says a student at South Valley Middle School may have exposed other children to measles. A student at Liberty North High School also contracted measles, but school officials say that this teen was absent from class while contagious. The district alerted parents from both schools. This is the third case of the measles in that district. Recent cases prompting one doctor to post about ways to prevent getting the measles. But new here at 10 o'clock, 41 Action News reporter Dia Wall explains this backlash was swift, right Dia? Yeah, it came pretty quickly, but parents out there are worried, as you can imagine, with all of these measles outbreaks happening. One local pediatrician put a post up to educate parents on the measles outbreak, and it went viral, all because of controversy over vaccines. So this morning I was cleaning out our oldest son's backpack and saw that we had a letter from the school. Yeah. Kristen Kleffner is a mom of four, Cole, Augie, Sammy, and Emmy. We've done everything we can on our end, but that doesn't necessarily mean they're still safe. Here at Priority Care Pediatrics, that starts with the vaccine. Measles is one of the most contagious illnesses out there. So it's a scary thing, especially when we know we have an immunization that can prevent this from happening. Dr. Raymond Catania wanted to educate parents like Kristen, who may be worried about the outbreak. And so we posted a simple uh, post from Children's Mercy and said, hey, here's some signs. Here's what to watch for. Give us a call if you have any concerns. Reaction was swift with people writing one in 68 children have autism. One in 42 boys have autism. You'd think you'd actually be worried about that instead of a few cases of measles and be smarter than your doctors and don't vaccinate. Irresponsible parenting is alive and well. Reading comment after comment after comment, you just kind of get worn down, right? Because you know you're fighting the good fight. You're on the right side of science, right? Um, but you worry that what they are saying, people will actually believe. And when that happens, kids are put at risk for no reason. Kids like Kristen's. You hear about measles outbreaks, but you don't realize it's gonna hit so close to home. The science is clear. This is about saving kids' lives. Dr. Catania's office requires patients follow the CDC immunization schedule for their kids. And because measles is so contagious, he says it doesn't take much to go from an outbreak to an epidemic. Dia Wall, 41 Action News. Dia, thank you.